Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, SciTechRoo. Finally friends, the software update has been arrived in my Realme X1 Max and most of the users started to receive the update as well, A.19. And in this video, I'm going to discuss about the size and the features. So don't worry regarding the Badwoman's mobile game, I need to do the testing in my own unit, uh, testing that whether the phone supports 90 FPS or not. Because some of the users are actually messaging that the Badwoman's mobile game, it's playing around uh, only 70 FPS even after the A.19 update as well. As you can see, these are the comments which I'm getting regarding the update. So today should be the most of the users, they should start receiving the update. I think this is the last batch of users. So right now, as you can see, so many co comments I'm getting regarding this Realme X and Max update. So first, let's see what is the size and what are the features. In next upcoming videos, I'll definitely try to test the Badwoman's mobile game 90 FPS working or not. So first thing is that the size of the update is about close to 244 MB is the size. And uh, this update includes the Android security patch, improved system stability and optimized power usage and fixed some known issues. Updated to the Android security patch September 2021. It's it's the latest one. T today's the data is about close to 11th of October. So this is the last month security patch. So it's been like 10 days we are waiting for this update to arrive. So finally it did arrive in this phone. And next is optimize system performance and the improve system stability. And I fixed the problem that lagging when sliding the desktop at lower probabilities. Fixed the problem at that the application installation package will be deleted at the lower problem and network fixes the problem that call forwarding and call waiting option do not work in some scenes at low probability. So these are the things which got fixed and these are the things you should know before you actually update and let's see how much time it actually takes to completely update this process. So right now I'm not trying to start the stopwatch right now because the internet speed depends upon one user to other user. So once it's download finishes and when it's installing then I'll try to start the stopwatch. So in this way we'll be able to know how much time it actually takes to install the latest update in the realme x and max device so in case if you have any queries let me know in the conversation below friends and definitely i'll be able to help you out with that and as i said my first priority will be testing the bad events mobile game 90 fps if it's not working how to make it work 90 fps so these are the few things which i'll try to definitely discuss uh, in the next upcoming videos so wish you should be uh stay tuned for my channel for this kind of videos and right now it's started to completely finished download and update now i did click at same time and the stopwatch also now we're gonna see how much time it actually takes to install this is a very small update so it should not take much time or all in terms of the updating so let me know in the conversation what are other things you want me to test in this device after the recent update definitely i'll try to do those kind of testings as soon as possible and right now it will try to boot up for some time finally right now it's happening with the 5x5 five five stage as you can clearly see final stage of update and you can see the time as well how much time it actually took it took kind of close to 5 minutes of time completely to update this uh, process so right now I think it should be kind of booting up and definitely friends I'll try to test the battery on mobile game and other games as well so make sure to stay tuned for those videos in case if you're interested to know whether they are working or not and I'm really curious to see how is the performance going to handle in this device because in every update the performance keeps on changing. I mean sometimes it increases, sometimes it decreases. So we need to even focus on the performance wise in this phone. So finally it's kind of uh, booting up at this point and uh, it should be finished any minute. Let's see how much more time it's going to take in the logo itself. Some phones they'll st stuck with the logo for long amount of time. So yes, I think that's what is happening right now at this moment. It's taking a little bit kind of time for the logo only. So really me. So during this time, don't press any kind of power button. Finally finished around six minutes of time. So total time it took about close to six minutes of time to completely install this update in the Realme X and Max device. That's it friends. Thank you for watching this video. And in case if you have any other queries, let me know in the conversation below. I'll definitely do the testing on this device today itself. So make sure to follow me, follow my channel regularly for the today. And see you in the next video. And let's stay tuned. Meanwhile, signing off. Bye.